Hey y'all, welcome back to Spirit of the Outdoors. You can see we're doing a little driving right now. Where we're actually at is we're rolling through some of the side streets in West Point, Mississippi, fixing to stop at Dukes Con. Uh, looks like we're gonna have a trapping job coming up pretty soon, doing some beavers. Uh, so what I wanna do, y'all know that I mostly run a, uh, a Duke one and a half for, cause I trap a lot of fox. That's what I mainly target on where I'm at and do most of my trapping around my place. But uh, I've got four number four Dukes that I run. I want to try out those 650s. So I'm thinking I'm either gonna get me a couple of those 650s. Now they make an 850 now. Uh, but I have heard a few reports and I don't know how widespread. They haven't been out long enough, no, but those guys getting broke legs by beavers that's running those 850s in my opinion it's, it's a little bit too much trap for me anyway uh, i don't i don't need a trap that big but i am going to see about get me some 650s so i'll show you where we're going to pull up i don't know if they're going to let me film on the inside i probably not i may sneak a clip or two but i'm not planning on going here and just like filming everything but i will show you where i'm pulling up at right quick duke's pecan west point mississippi Well, while we was at it, we went ahead and got us some snares, four bottles, tannin solution, and some red fox urine, some beaver lure. Now I have four springs for a 330 conibear. I've got two traps that I got give to me that you the springs are broke. Y'all look at this. We're going to try these 650s out. Center swivel. That's a big trap. I don't know if y'all can see the building back there behind me. We're driving off from Duke's Pecan. I can't tell y'all what I spent on that little package of goodies. I can promise you this. It's a whole lot cheaper drive right there and buy it with green stamps than it is to order. But anyway, I just want to do a uh, quick video while I was picking this stuff up. I know a lot of a lot of you trapping guys like to order Duke's trap. And I know there's a lot of people out there that hate Duke traps. I don't know what their deal is. You mentioned Duke traps and they ask junk, 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 but they're using these bridges and stuff and they all made in Taiwan and whatnot. It ain't no different. <laughs> So anyway, I love Duke traps. I'm always gonna trap with Duke traps as long as they make a decent trap. And that is a monster of a trap, I'll tell you. That's 650. They make 850, but it's too much for me. Uh, but I'm looking forward to trying those out. Uh, I may do a video on replacing those springs on that um, 330, cause I, like I said, I had two of them that were given to me and they were broke when I got them. I don't know how they got broke. I've never had one break, uh, but they do offer parts and they wouldn't, I think each spring may have been, I, I don't I'll have to look back to see what he charged me. I don't know, they, they wouldn't a whole lot. You can buy two replacement springs a whole lot cheaper than you can buy a new trout, uh, if you mind to change them. But anyway, just a little quick video. We'll see y'all next time on Spirit of the Outdoors. 